Why are pianos hard to record? And they are, to get them right. Uh, Manny in Manila in the Philippines wants to know, and Manny writes to me, Good day, Paul. Good day, Manny. I often hear and read that the sound coming from an acoustic piano is the most difficult to record in terms of making it sound realistic in reproduction. This seems to be true because when I hear piano in vinyl, CD, and other audio sources, the sound seems kind of unnatural or not very close compared to the sound of, say, a recorded saxophone, flute, or violin. Why is that? How is that so? Well, the quick answer to that, Manny, is size. So, you know, if I've got a sax playing over here, I can take this microphone and I can point it, you know, right at my sax, pick up some of the room, play my sax, and it's going to capture most of what's going on. But a piano is so much bigger, and so much of the sound is dependent on the, the body of the piano. I mean, that's how it amplifies the sound. So if you have ever been around a big piano, get close to it and put your head, move your head around, you know, here and here as it's playing. And when you get on this side, you know, the, the right hand strings, the upper strings, are, are very pronounced with the lower frequencies not so pronounced. And it's, it's you, you can hear the problem. It's just the size of the thing and the breadth of its frequencies. Saxophones, trumpets have a fairly small bundle of, of frequencies. Uh, we recently uh, recorded Don Grusin, Dave Grusin's brother, and Don is just a fabulous pianist. I mean, this guy is hot. Wait till you hear this octave recording. It's amazing. But when we recorded him, Gus Skinnis, we, we brought in some big guns. We brought in uh, some fellows from Telarc and their microphones and their expertise, and it was the most difficult recording project we've yet done at Octave Records. When you hear it, Manny, you're going to change your opinion about the fact that most of the things, well, no, you won't change that, but you'll change your opinion about not being able to hear a piano reproduced properly, because for the first time, it is extraordinary. It's like he's in the room, but that was hard. That took five microphones, some real skill, the DSD system, the Sonoma Mastering and Recording System, Gus Guinness and two other guys, and they worked for, you know, two days to get it right. Because putting the microphones, you know, in an area where it's, it picks up evenly so that the, right, uh, the left hand and the right hand have the same levels. Oh, I mean, I, I, I missed that session. I wish I had gone, but I didn't. But I know it was terribly difficult, and I know that's the reason why. So single instruments, not so bad. You can do that, they're, they're pretty easy. You can, you can hear them, guitars, all that. There's a skill to all of it, but pianos, yes sir, Bob, they are hard. And I can't wait for you to hear Don Grusin's album. I, I think it's gonna be our first release on Octave Records. So stay tuned for that. All right, thanks for the question. I'll talk to you later.